Hi, I'm Scott Pritchett with the Office of Instructional Resources. Many UCF classrooms have been configured with a microphone and webcam to accommodate the BlendFlex model of teaching this fall. This video will show you how to use a BlendFlex equipped classroom with Zoom or Panopto. Some classrooms may have slight variations. Each room will have a printed guide specific to the equipment in that room. OIR is ready to assist you in using the equipment in any of these rooms. UCF Facilities is providing sanitizing wipes near all classroom spaces. We encourage you to use one to wipe down the equipment before use. You can turn on the multimedia system by touching the control panel or by using a stylus to limit your contact. Don't forget to wipe off your stylus after use. We've set up the rooms so they will still work the way they used to. However, there are a few things you will need to keep in mind for the students at a distance. First, you will always need to use a microphone. If the room is equipped with a wireless microphone, the best practice is to place it on your shirt or lapel. Turn it on and unmute the mic. For rooms without a wireless mic, we've installed a wired mic on the desktop. Please note the location and stay close, keeping it uncovered while you teach. It is best practice not to discuss personal or student matters near the microphones, even when they are not on. Now we need to connect your students with the classroom. We've added webcams to all of these rooms, so make a note of where the camera is and what it can see in the app. If you are using Zoom, your microphone and webcam should be automatically detected when you open the app. If you need to select a different camera or adjust the mic settings, this can be done from the settings menu. The students can only see what the camera sees or what you share on the computer. If you are only going to lecture, please make sure you can be seen on the camera. If you're going to use the computer during class, click Share Screen in the Zoom app and select what you want to share. You will still need to select Computer on the touch panel so the students in the room can see the computer. Please use the document camera instead of the whiteboard in the classroom. The whiteboard in the classroom will not show up well over the camera and the students at a distance won't see what you write. To share the document camera, first select it on the touch panel. Share your desktop in Zoom. On the window that pops up, select the Advanced option along the top. Then, select the icon that says Content from Second Camera. The icon looks like a document camera. Click Share. You can click Switch Camera in the top left-hand corner to switch between the document camera and webcam. You will now see the document camera image on the computer, and students at a distance will see it too. If you are using Panopto, open the desktop client, sign in through Web Courses UCF, and select the folder for the course you wish to record to. If you wish to webcast, check the webcast checkbox in the top right corner. Make sure the correct camera, microphone, and sources are selected. Ensure USB video is selected as a secondary source and choose your computer, laptop, or document camera from the touch panel. This can be changed from the touch panel while recording. Now click record. You can still connect your laptop using the HDMI cable in the room and selecting laptop on the touch panel. When class is over, don't forget to end the Zoom session or stop the Panopto recording or webcast. Your Panopto recording will be available in your web course after it has finished uploading. Please remember to sign off of the classroom PC, return the wireless mic to its base station if you used one, shut down the multimedia system, and sanitize the equipment and area you are using. Thanks for watching. Contact OIR Classroom Support for more information or assistance.